So this question looks like it's going to be a translate word problem question. TWP questions are typically four or more lines long. So, you know, this question fits that bill. And all we want to do to solve these is to really pay attention to each sentence separately, making sure to write down any quantitative information, and making sure we understand what we read before moving on to the next sentence. So the first sentence here says an object is kicked from a platform. So I'm going to actually draw a picture and say, well, that's my platform. There's my object, right? It's going to be kicked. So it's going to go something like this. The equation this represents the situation where H is the height of the object above the ground. Okay, so here's the ground. So H, you know, like that would be H, right, at its height. But these are all H values above the ground. Uh, let's see, what else does it say? Uh, H is the height of the object above the ground in meters, T seconds after it is kicked. Okay, which number represents the height in meters from which the object was kicked? Oh, so which number represents just this? So the object is here in my picture. So let me just put plug in picture here because I think it is useful to have a visual here. So the object is here on the platform. So which number represents the, which number represents the height in meters from which the object was kicked? Well, that would mean that we're at t equals zero. That means like before we kick the object, right? What would the h value be before we kick the object? That would be using this equation, this function, negative 4.9 t squared plus 7 t plus 9. But we care about what's happening with the ball before it's kicked, so where t is zero. So if t is equal to zero, then this whole thing becomes zero. This also becomes zero. And all we're left with is that h is equal to 9. So our answer here must be choice D.